split the proposed project will split into two phases. Mm -hmm. Phase one is between 2019 to 2020 with uh, with an estimated capex amount of X. Okay? All right. Um, the scope of phase one will basically include the acquisition of land, um, construction of warehouse, and construction of the berth or five berths for for the for the supply vessels to berth. And subse subsequently, phase two, which is which is envisaged to be to happen in 2021 to 2022, we require a capex investment of RMY, and that will the scope of phase two will basically comprise of pipelines, uh, construction of storage tanks, and also the facilitation of an open yard. Uh huh. All right. Um, the team has looked into the commercial side of this project. Mm -hmm. And we have taken the initiative to approach a few customers, um, a few key customers, the sharing contractors in the in the area. And the discussions with the potential customers A, B, and C revealed that they have already signed a long-term usage agreement with a competing facility named Competitor Y. Uh -huh. And unfortunately, A, B, and C they constitute approximately 70% of the offshore activities in that particular area. Um, secondly, we have looked into the technical side of the project, the location. The proposed location is, uh, will take 10 hours for a vessel to travel single journey between the supply base and the, and the uh, project area. And if this was, com this was to be compared with the competitor Y, its location is only is 50 percent. Its location um, it will take 50 percent longer to travel. Um, finally, we have looked into in the mass investment. Uh, with all this in mind, we have looked into the um, invest the financial viability of the project. Um, according to the information given by the com by company X. Um, this project, um, the supply base, the facility, will be able to um, attract P amount of volume, cargo volume per year, which will generate 40% in returns. However, um, however, with our due diligence study, we have seen, we have, our findings reveal that it will only attract Q metric tons of cargo throughput a year which only generate 5% of returns. A summary of our key findings, the IR is 5% based on our findings, mm -hmm. which is significantly lower than the 12% returns that the company has designated for any projects that we have to pursue. Correct. Secondly, key customers A, B, and C, they have already been um, signed, they have already signed long-term usage agreements with competitor Y. Therefore, attracting customers will be very challenging for this project. And finally, the proposed, proposed location is not a strategy. Finally, our recommendation, uh, taking, the, taking the above into account, our recommendation to management would be, would be not to pursue this project for any further, and we will leave the final decision to the management. Thank you very much. Ah, okay.